The Coast Guard intercepted a suspected smuggling vessel on San Diego waters today. They say they have found more than a dozen undocumented immigrants on board during a routine boarding. Good evening, I'm Vanessa Van Hefti. As ABC 10 News reporter Anthony Perra shows us, this comes during a time of increased maritime patrols along our coast. Several undocumented migrants were discovered on board a vessel on San Diego waters, according to officials with the U.S. Coast Guard and Customs and Border Protection. According to a U.S. Border Patrol official, before 1 p.m. Sunday, the Coast Guard informed them they had intercepted a suspected smuggling vessel off Mission Beach. The Border Patrol official says there were 17 people on board who were transported to lifeguard headquarters and turned over to Border Patrol and were later determined to be undocumented. The incident remains under investigation. Both the Coast Guard and CBP announced they have increased patrols this weekend. It comes after several deadly incidents off San Diego waters. Just over a week ago, a person died after a panga boat carrying more than a dozen migrants capsized near La Jolla shores. And earlier in the month, three people died when an overcrowded boat with 30 people on board broke apart near the Cabrillo National Monument. Earlier this month, ABC 10 News spoke with Dr. Ev Mead, a professor at the University of San Diego, about the apparent increase in maritime smuggling incidents. He says due to a number of factors, the situation for migrants at the border hasn't changed much, and people are staying for months or years at camps waiting for a chance at asylum. Experts believe the end result is that many feel they don't have a shot at asylum. They tried to go to the port of entry, they tried to enter in a more orderly fashion, and they've been turned away. What happens? Um, that's the same thing as people who've been waiting for a couple of years to apply for asylum. They try the desert. They try the river. They try the Otay Mountains. They try the ocean. Anthony Pura, ABC 10 News. And you can keep track of new developments on this story by heading to our website at 10news.com. San Diego hotels, restaurants, and tourist attractions are busy once again for Memorial Weekend. They are rebounding after being largely shut down a year ago. With social distancing restrictions easing amid increased vaccine distribution, the Auto Club says San Diego is once again a top tourist destination for Memorial Day weekend. Last year, many of those same vaccinations had to be canceled amid the outbreak, uh, vacations that is, but things are different this year at restaurants like Diana Patrick's Seaport Village Restaurant restaurant uh, the San Diego call uh, pier. The line extended down the nearby retaining wall there. She says the demand is so high the visits are above where they were in May of 2019, which is the year before.